The following program is brought to you in living color on NBC. This is Bob Atkinson, manufacturer and business manager. He's been married for five years to lovely actress Denise Darcel. <laughs> this is Nancy Culp. She's been married for eight years to co-star of NBC's new series, I Spy, Robert Culp. <laughs> and hello there, my name is Jack Nars. The name of our game, I'll bet. As you all know by now, the uh, object of I'll, I'll bet is the game where it's not how much you know that counts, but how much you know about your husband or wife. I almost gave my brother's intro. Each team, by the way, will be playing for a viewer from NBC television areas that were chosen in a drawing held before our studio audience. We'll reveal those areas and pick the winners at the conclusion of the program. Right now, Bob Atkinson, would you join me in listening to the first question, please? What sea parted to allow Moses and the Israelites to escape from the Egyptians? Now, you'll be betting on Denise's ability to answer the question in just a moment. Right now, a message about two quality products from the Carnation Company. Strike three. Coffee time. When you bring out the coffee, bring out coffee's true rich flavor with Coffee Mate, the non-dairy coffee creamer. It needs no refrigeration. It costs less than one cent per serving. Best of all, coffee tastes best with Coffee Mate. Try it. Woman, wife, mother. Her family is all important to her. That's why she gives them the nourishment of Carnation Instant Non-Fat Dry Milk. One quart of Carnation Instant supplies half the daily amount of protein recommended by the National Research Council. Yet it costs as little as nine cents a quart. Penny for penny, Carnation Instant gives you four times more protein than steak. Carnation takes sweet, fresh milk and removes the water and fat. Glass for glass, you get more protein in place of the fat, more calcium and riboflavin, too. Serve your family Carnation Instant soon. The object of all bet is to decide whether or not your husband or wife can answer a question within the time limit, then back up that decision with a bet of up to $100. Uh, the first couple that reaches 200 wins. However, should you go 200 in the hole, you will lose. All right, Bob Atkinson, you heard the first question. Would you please make the first bet now? Denise, what sea parted to allow Moses and the Israelites to escape from the Egyptians? Oh, the, the, oh, I know it so well I die. Oh, the Dead Sea. The Dead Sea? Don't tell me. Oh, I die. Just a little more time. Okay. I know it so well. Don't, don't stop me now. No, okay. <laughs> I'm... I'm I'm sorry. You didn't get it. What tell me? The red. Oh, the red. Oh, and that's going to cost you. What did you put? You better put. I knew. I knew it. Yes, but you yes, didn't, you didn't yes, come out with the answer. It. It's going to cost you $100. Oh, I'm so mad. You're mine. The, red, the <clears> easiest thing in the whole right, world. Right. The easiest thing in the whole world. The easiest question I've ever known in my life. I don't say it. Here we go. I'm so annoyed. Well, don't be. We're going to give you another chance in a minute. Nancy, let's listen to this one. Who wrote the famous Canterbury Tales? That is Bob's first question. Let's see what you think he'll do with it. Bob, who wrote the famous Canterbury Tales? You better bet right on this one, dear. <laughs> Chaucer. Chaucer is right, and she bet right. <laughs> We made the right bet. You are plus 60. Now, Denise, we listen in. I'm still hurt about the red seat. <laughs> <laughs> Baseball games are divided into innings. What are bowling games divided into? That's the question we'll ask your husband. You are minus 100, Denise. The only way is I up. I want to go the way. I don't know. All the way. Okay. But we don't know which way. All the way. Okay, Bob. Baseball games are divided into innings. What are bowling games divided into? Frames. Frames is right. Right after. Leave it on the board. 